Challenge Prov. Yes! Fringe Prov is the game show where we will improvise the entire Fringe Festival for you. Um, I'm your host, Brian Polly, and let's introduce our cast. I'm Rita. I'm Connor. I'm Amanda. I'm Megan. I'm Courtney. I'm Cameron. <laughs> Are you sure? Yes. All right, let me explain how all of this works. Um, it's very simple. Inside of this box are all the shows in the Fringe Festival, except for the ones that we've already done. Uh, so these are all the ones that are left that we get to do. Um, we will draw a show from the box, and it will have the uh, show's description that's in the show program, in the Fringe program. We will read the description, and then they will have three minutes to perform the show for you. Uh, based on that description. It's <laughs> as simple as that. Or is it? <laughs> There's a couple of rules. If uh, someone on the team has already seen the show, they can't perform it. Can't perform any show that they've seen. Everyone on the show, or on the team, has seen the show, then it goes to the other team, and they get to do it. Uh, and most importantly, after they perform their scene, it gets judged by the critic. It could be one of you. Uh, there might be some other rules. <laughs> but the rules aren't that important. Uh, the important thing is that we uh, binge the fringe. So let's do our first show. Yeah. Let's choose a show. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got. Um, if I might ask, uh, which team would you like to go first, blue or red? Hmm, red. Red team first. Good choice. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Your arms now. <laughs> uh, the show they chose is called That Woman. The Monologue Show <laughs> by the Tennessee Playwright Studio. So I'll just read the description here and see what the show's all about. Perspectives of women involved with President John F. Kennedy, including Ellen Rom Romich, Blaze Starr, Mimi Alford, Mary Pinchot, and Mary Pinchot Meyer, and Judith Exner, and of course Jacqueline, Jacqueline Kennedy Onassis. Um, stagecritic.com said pieces that reach beyond decades of headlines, books, and broadcast documentaries regarding President Kennedy's extramarital affair, affairs for the humanity and individuality of the women either revealed or alleged to have been involved with him. So, that woman. That woman, the monologue show. Name, Blaze Star. I bet you don't know it. Back then, he was just John, and I was Miss Star, the neighbor. He would kick his ball over my fence, and he would knock on my door and say, Can I get my ball? Hey, can I get my ball? You know, that famous JFK accent. <laughs> <laughs> and I would say, Sure, just go on through. And I knew that kid was going to be a president one day. <laughs> but I was also dealing with my own stuff. Endometriosis. Oh. And, <laughs> and I'm a person too. It's me, Jackie O. You think I didn't know about all this? You think that I didn't? I didn't intuitively know that there was something else going on then. You're wrong. Because I see through that man. I know. I know the lies. And I know the trade-offs. And I know that I was willing to love, even if it hurt me. <laughs> no, doll, she doesn't know a thing. <laughs> <laughs> She's got no suspicion. Are you sure? Should I come over to the family house? Yeah, bring the kids. 
kids. Oh, yes, our secret kids. I don't think that's true, but the real kids. Oh, hey, Jackie, baby. Uh. You know, the funny thing is, is that they thought he ran the country. When really, I know that I was running the show. <laughs> So, how many, like, blasters do you want on the moon rocket, Miss O? I don't know, Blaze Star, I mean... <laughs> <laughs> how, I mean, we're going to visit Blaze Star, your own star, so Thank I you think... for naming it after me, Miss O. It, I feel very respected. <laughs> I don't know how many. I think it's up to you. I think you have a voice, too, that should be <laughs> Miss O, I yes. am choosing five blasters for the rocket. That sounds like a perfect number. <laughs> <laughs> uh, honey, I thought I heard you say something about going to the star in a rocket. Well, We're supposed to be going to the moon. Just, you know, I will, I'll love you to the moon and back, but I know. I know that I just have to support other people's dreams. I'm not going to space, but Blaze Star can do whatever Blaze Star wants. I'm still Jackie O, and I still love the country. Oh, okay, okay. Well, can we just make sure that it's a convertible whenever we go on that uh, parade? <laughs> <laughs> My name is the Moon, and I am also a woman in JFK's life. <laughs> we were a part that. <laughs> Of course, at Friends Prom, the only reason we have rules is so that we can break them. <laughs> break the rules. I've got the most important front of us to ask if uh, anyone on this team has seen uh, that woman. So, good. And is anyone from that woman in the audience tonight? Anyone from the show? No? Has anyone seen the show? You saw the show? Whoa. All right. Uh, you can both call it down. Come on down. We worked on this first, but we can do it second. It looks like you guys are in a show too. Uh, yes, Romantic Fools. Uh, Romantic tomorrow Fools. night at 10 10 30, yeah. right? And then Saturday at 9. So Woo! Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Okay. It was it was it. Excellent. <laughs> <laughs> no thought for that. Mm -hmm. All right. We would have brought you, you might before have been pretty. But now we're bringing you down now to be the critic. So if you could just give us uh, your opinion. You've seen that woman. Mm -hmm. um, so you can tell us how it compares to, compares to our red team here. Well, Blaze Star is a former stripper. So, yeah. I played you that way. <laughs> I, I felt it was good. Yeah. yeah. Um, I, you know, I thought Jackie O's performance was very interesting, very fun. Yeah. <laughs> That's a good um, JFK looks a little different from what I remember. <laughs> I, think, I thought they did a great job. The performance, he was more inferred than actually more, there. Actually there, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, her presence is on stage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Absolutely. Cool. So how many points would you like to give the red team? That's like the max in the room. Oh, um, there's no max in the room. Q? And Q. But I wouldn't go past Q. Uh, I'd say 4,312. What? Take that, blue team. Oh, yeah. 